Hello everyone, I'm back on Dark Souls and I'm currently in the spot where in the last video I beat the Capra Demon first try. I'm just too good, I'm just too good. Just completely ignore the fact that I died about a hundred fucking times to the Gargoyles. Just, that's not important. Just forget about that. I'm aiming to ring the second bell in this video, which does mean we get the fun of both the depths and everyone's favourite place, the Light Tower. And depending on how much time there is after that, I'd like to do the Moonlight Butterfly and maybe some other shit as well. But it's kind of a waste of time because being real, we're probably gonna be spending a lot of time in Blight Town. <laughs> there, there probably won't be time. We'll keep, we'll keep vitality and strength equal. That's what I normally do. Whether that's a good idea or not, I don't know. It probably isn't, but that's what I do. We're going to do one on this, so hopefully we can cover up the legs. Can we do it? Can we do the impossible? They said it would never happen. No way. Okay, I'm, that's the best thing that's going to happen in this video. Can we wear the gloves or gauntlets? No, no, those, <laughs> those are too heavy. They're very heavy gloves, but that's good. That is good. Look, it's been about five minutes and we're already making progress. I know I just said that we were going to do the depths and Blight Town first <laughs> and if we got time we do the other stuff but I forgot I'd have to come here to upgrade so I might as well just do them first to be honest. Fucking hell, how I forgot when Howard's friends show up. Okay it was nice to meet you Howard. Yeah, shut the fuck up. I could just kill these guys. I mean, what's stopping me? What is stopping me from going for this backstab? Come on. Howard's friend. He's not going to see it coming. No, it, it just feels too wrong. I'm going to leave him. I will even be. Right, entering the land of the bush people. They're in the woods. They're in the woods. I fucking hate seeing one of those up there. Cause I just, I, I feel like I have to try and get to it. But I got I, I almost, I was going to say I had no idea. <laughs> Too good, and it and it did the wall as well. Nice. Okay, let's just hope we have enough arrows. I mean, it's not really a big deal. It's not like the butterfly is gonna end my life without arrows. It's just it's so fucking boring to fight without green arrowing. Green arrowing. I mean, is is arrowing a word? We can just very calmly get that. Thank you very much. Don't mind me. Thank you. Oh yeah, these are the living trees, right? Was it right on? Is it the snake on the tree or is it the tree living? That's the snake. I'm sure there's living trees. I'm actually dead. At least being dead and respawning, I can actually try the armor on. We're good. Nice new outfit. Okay, we're going back. We're going back. Okay. Alright. This boss fight, this is designed for the green arrow. It is in the game for that one reason. Okay, 60 down. Okay, that is pretty shit. Oh god, like, fucking hell. Okay. We might be here a while. Is he flying down? Yes, here we go. When does he do- Okay, there's the airway. Not even half health. Am I dead? Am I- <gasps> I'm not dead, please. Please fucking butterfly have mercy upon me. <laughs> okay, now I know my life is in danger if I can't avoid that. Okay, please, just let me get some good damage. <laughs> he says kicking back some- now, What the fuck is he doing now? What? I've never even seen that before. How- what? I don't know why he's doing that, but I mean it's because he's a c- Oh no, not the beam. I forgot about the beam. <laughs> oh, one Estus. I'm so bad. Okay, he's coming down. This We can finish him off. No, we're going to play it safe. We're going to finish him off Green Arrow style. Come on, kill him. He has to die, yes. Fuck this guy. Fuck this guy. I know he's just a poor butterfly, but he tried to kill me. He tried to kill you, Rick. 
You gonna bring, bring it back, back to where Lloyd sleeps? sleeps? To where Carl sleeps? sleeps? I'm gonna stop with the Shane impressions now. All right, now time for the depths. I'm just gonna PowerPoint transition over there. It's my favorite method of transport. All right, fun awaits behind this door. Here we go. Do -do 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 -do. Damn, this guy's getting the backstab down there. I kind of wish I could just sit up here and watch him instead of going any further. Fatty heads. Oh my, okay, he actually is trying to come after me. He destroyed his own table. What, this man is, he's fucking lost it. I'm a little scared to be honest. He's just, he's completely unhinged. I'm fearing for my life. He's destroying more tables. He cannot be stopped. What is he doing? Look at that sack he wears on his head. This is who Scarecrow wants to be. This guy is a true master of fear. When he gets out of depth, he's gonna burn Gotham to the ground. Banana! All right, Scarecrow is dead. Honestly, he should have been his own boss fight. This guy, he's terrifying. Yeah, the bonfire should just be up there, right? I think, what even is this thing? It's like a fucking bin bag on my head and it does loads of damage. The bin bag is already attacking before I can move. Why? As long as I don't accidentally come across the frogs, then it's okay. Sewer chamber key. That, hang on. Please tell me that opens the door that I found. I can backtrack. Don't make me fight the frogs yet. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Why is the bin bag trying to go through the door? I do 18 damage. I will be here forever. Yes, it was actually worth it. I can't believe it. I was fully expecting to see door locked. Oh no, no, no. Are you kidding? I forgot about this guy. Boss fight time. Unofficial boss fight. All right, we've got to use the pillars. We've got to use the pillars. That's the strat. I'm just too good at that boss now. And we got the sack. I'm going to wear it as a trophy of my, my victory over Scarecrow. Gotham's going to burn, Batman. There he is. Thank you. I am Luensius. Or the Great Swamp. Alright, I'm gonna leave this very friendly gentleman in peace. We don't have a choice. I'm gonna have to fight the frogs. Now, I hate these things so much. They're just disgusting. I hate the fact they look like they got big eyes, but they've actually got small ones. What the hell? That is the most repulsive thing about them. And obviously, I also hate the fact that if they kill me, my health bar is halved. I do have a purging stone, but... Hopefully we won't need to use it because we're fucking going in. Here we go. Where's the frogs? There's a rat. Wait, hang on. No, there he is. There he is. Ah! No, 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 no. You disgusting fucking piece of shit. Die, 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 die. If anyone else hates the frogs as much as I do, please tell me. Uh, tell me I'm not alone in my absolute hatred for these creatures. Look, just look at them behind that fence. See, see those big, disgusting fucking balls of shite on the top of their heads that look like eyes? That's not their eyes, those small little dots right there. Oh my, please don't you fucking come over here. <laughs> oh, fuck me, Mr. Rat, you scared the fuck out of me. Wait, well, no, 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 we're good, we're good. We're good, no more frogs. Don't want to speak too soon, but I'm pretty sure the frogs are the other way. Okay, all I got to do now is beat the gaping dragon without taking any damage whatsoever. Okay, so cutting the tail off is it's normally the way to go with these things. That's why I remember being distracted to do. I don't know how your fucking tail's still attached. I'm gonna die. I'm actually just gonna die. Yep, what a prediction. Why, why do I play this game? Why am I doing a playthrough on Dark Souls? I could be playing Bloodborne. I, I like Bloodborne. I like this game too, but I'm better at Bloodborne than I am at this game. I'm not even that good at Bloodborne, but I'm really not good at this game. I'm going to the right this time. We're going to mix it up. That may have been a mistake. He's walking away from me. Come back here, big lumbering fuck. There we go. I love how he tries to swing his tail even though he doesn't have it. That's it. You just walk towards that wall. Okay, let me get this straight. I just got killed 
by nothing. I walked into his tail and it killed me. What the hell? Okay, we're gonna put the helmet back on. I don't know, maybe it'll just make it less shit. Why am I fat rolling all of a sudden? Why the f- I- Why am I fucking fat rolling? I don't mind if I die to be honest. I just really want to get my normal roll back. Alright, uh, we'll, we'll do that. A thousand souls. Hopefully, with the nice power of gold pine resin, we can actually do some damage to this guy. Otherwise we are going to be here forever. How much damage do I do? That's way better. I right, get that damage. And we're back to normal. Oh, I can hit his head, can't I? Right, that's some decent damage, but we're gonna wanna run. We're gonna wanna run. Oh my god. Ah, look at that damage. What the fuck? Alright, we're so close. One more hit, pretty much. Thank fucking lord. Oh my days, what? I mean, my celebration won't last long because we do have the Blight Town key, and that is not really a good thing. Hell no, man. Gates to some fun times through there. But I, I'm out of time right now, so I'm going to. I'm going to play this again. Uh, it might be tomorrow, it might be in two months. We'll find out. I'll, I'll let you know, but I'll, I'll see you whenever. I'll be back. I'll be back. All right. Uh, so, at the end of what I recorded last time, I'm, I made a joke where I said I'm either going to be recording the next bit tomorrow or in two months. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know what happened really. I really don't. Again, it's been a lot longer than I intended since the last time. But in that time, I, I have made an entire other video. I got a new microphone, which I kind of know how to use properly. I got married, uh, I got a new car, uh, I didn't get my hair cut, and I'm also going to be Max Verstappen's teammate next year. What the fuck is that? Hello there. You can decide uh, which ones out of those you want to believe. Fun times in Blight Town await beyond these very scary gates. Actually, they're quite intimidating, I can't lie. The sudden change in um, lighting <laughs> is also pretty intimidating. We're fine. And we're not. We're fine. And we're not. I know I used the fucking key. Stop telling me. Watching back what I've already done and edited, I've spent most of this video so far uh, getting angry and swearing uh, while talking about frogs and a butterfly. So maybe I'll find something in Blight Town, some other animal I can get really angry at. Okay, here he is. Here's the big boy. Let's get it. See if we can parry him straight away. That doesn't look like something I can parry. Ah, I'm the poison. I forgot about that. I'm determined to get this parry. What? See, I'm the worst player in the world. Okay. I'll take it back. Okay, I didn't even get the fucking parry. No damage. I'm out of Estus. You know what? Right, I'm going out on my own fucking terms. <laughs> I can now see why it's taken me four months to play this game again. All right, let's try this again. Let's see if I can actually defeat a normal enemy. Okay, I'm in my parry practice. There we go, and that should kick him off the edge, right? No, it's too good to be true. We're cutting all that out of the video. So since four months is apparently enough time to get even shitter at this game, I'm just gonna leave this guy to do whatever the fuck he does. Fuck off. Fuck off as well. Fuck off as well. Yeah, I may be out of luck here. Somehow I defy all the odds and I'm still alive. I think there was a bonfire over here. There is. Look at that. Doesn't that make my life easier? Okay, so a lot of people have died here. Again, tactics. Oh, it's the moving bridge, isn't it? All right, let's try this one. All right, this guy just fucking died on the spot. <laughs> he didn't even get anywhere. 
Uh, this guy just went over there and died. I'm all about this one. Oh, uh, he's fucking Harry Potter and he died. No, so that's more like Gandalf. Alright, uh, moving bridge time. Is this the one? Have I looked at this one already? No, I haven't. Um. Yeah, okay. It's looking good. In fact, it even stopped. No, no, it hasn't stopped. We're good. We made it. That was a nice surprise. Why are there two? Oh my god. Oh, not the red dog. What is it with this game? Jump scares. How much damage? 74. What a, that is absolutely horrendous. Oh, fuck off. What is wrong with these f Maybe I've got some souls I can use to upgrade. I mean, I don't need the boss weapons, I could just use that. I will use the large soul of a nameless soldier. How much does that give me? Are you fucking kidding me? Right, come on. That's more like it. I've never used a boss soul uh, for, well, to get souls. I saved it for the, the trophy. And if I ever finish this playthrough, I'm probably never going to fucking touch it again. So I'm going to use the Moonlight Butterfly soul. How many souls do you give me? That is fucking pathetic. That is absolutely abysmal. I've... <sighs> Walk around, we go for the backstab. You know what? I didn't need it. I didn't need it. He's going to be eventually dead anyway. Any minute, when he falls off. Toxic. I don't care about that. What? Health. It's not an issue. Because I'm already dead. Full on attack. He's going to be dead before the dogs even get here. He is. That's how it's done. Now I switch to the shield. He's trying to gang up on me. That's not a problem. But I use the R2 button and then I get him both. This guy thinks he can get me. He doesn't know I dodge all the attacks. And I get him with the front stab. And I push him straight up the edge like the piece of shit he is. Good riddance. And there's another. He thinks he can attack me. I get the back stab. Not the front stab, I get the back stab this time. And I jump and I... I forgot to look at my health bar. Yeah, and I speed up the video. Because I can't be fucking bothered. Because I've already fought these guys and I already won. I don't need to prove myself again by fighting them again. Because I don't give a fuck. What the fuck even is this thing meant to be? And it's trying to kill me. And this guy's trying to kill me and that guy's trying to kill me. And I'm stuck on the fucking post and I'm dead. There's this fucking white stain in my way, but I dodge his attacks and I run straight past him and I'm dead. I'm so far ahead, he's not even near. This bell ends here and he misses as well and I missed the ladder, I missed- No, I missed the fucking ladder! And I reached a dead end, but that's not a problem, my directional skills are far above what is humanly possible because I've located the ladder that no one else has ever done other than everyone who's played the game and made it past this point and I've found the other ladder but I'm bleeding out and this fucking piece of shit is in my way stop eating my fucking head stop eating my head I can't move they're in my way I'm dead we're going the alternative route they're never gonna suspect the thing I press the Dark Souls 3 jump button and I'm fucking dead and so is this guy and those are both red dogs and that guy as well Right, I'm climbing. Oh, for fuck. At least I'm down, I guess. And I'm already back upright. And there's these disgusting creatures. So I'm going to hit him and kill him because he actually doesn't have much health, which is such a relief. I've been poisoned, but I, I know the bonfire's here. I don't care. Light the bonfire. So the scary thing is that since I did a speed run through Blight Town, I'm near the boss fight. Which is of course Spider Bitch. Uh, that's our official name. Just uh, check the wiki if you want. Look at that. Entirely undetected. That's how it's done. I'm now Batman. I was Scarecrow and now I'm Batman. Oh, that's another thing. At, at least Scarecrow wasn't down here. Imagine parkouring around Blight Town and you drop down and you find the greatest Bloodborne boss that I never was. Hold up! Oh my days, that is... 
not promising. I really need to watch an AOE, which I can't remember what the telegraph looks like, which is really unfortunate to be completely honest. Okay, is that the AOE? That's the AOE. Somehow it didn't one hit kill me. What a nice su surprise. Honestly, damage is looking pretty good. You know what? I feel like this is all under control for the time being. I'm out of Estus. It's slightly less under control now, but it could always be worse. That looks like AoE. Maybe I should always leave some stamina to roll away in case of the AoE. Okay, that's the AoE. And the animation is over, so I can now run back without getting killed. Is that the AoE? Yes. And we're back in action. Just like that, we're back in action. Keep. Keep going. This must be some really, really good gameplay. <laughs> really entertaining gameplay right here. Right, under half health. Not bad. Even if I die now, I could be proud of the amazing boring strat that I found. I don't want to do this again, but I don't want to lose a pine resin. See, I'm dead. But I could be proud of the damage. I hate this game. I hate this boss. It's like watching fucking paint dry. I'm gonna edit this video. I'm never- I will never make a video on this game again. For some reason in my head before I started playing- well, doing these Dark Souls videos, the idea of summoning- I, I don't know, I just never really thought about to do it. I guess from playing it on my own, I- Never really wanted to summon much because it kind of I feel like it takes away from the, maybe the boss experience. But to be honest, in this playthrough, I don't think I could give less of a fuck about that. So I may use a humanity to see if I can summon someone just to make it a bit more entertaining. Okay, reverse hollowing. That is what I need to do. No, I don't have time to fight you. I'm sorry. I know you, you're a big fly and you want to attack and kill me for some reason. I, I do kill a lot of flies. Too. I do hate them with an absolute passion. Dark Spirit. This is the complete opposite of what I wanted to happen. Can the Dark Spirit fuck off? Is that too much to ask? Why can you run in this shit? For fuck's sake. What is wrong with this game? I just want a fair 1v1. That's all I- that's what I want. Backstab. Finish off uh. the Dark Spirit. Fuck you. Fuck off. Humanity, thank you. And a butcher knife. Now I can not just look like Scarecrow, but play like him as well. I can summon Man-Eater Mildred. I cannot lose this fight. Success is the only option. Right, we're going in. We're going in. I got the pine resin. I have six Estus flasks. Man-Eater Mildred, what the fuck are you doing over there? Come here right now. What the hell is that? That's like when the boss gets angry in Mario Galaxy when you hit it three times. Oh, look at this, damn it. Watch out, Mildred. It could be the AoE any minute now. Like now? No! Ah, no, no, no. Drink the fucking Estus, you fucking piece of shit. I'm really getting into this. I could probably leave Mildred to handle this on her own, to be honest. But no, no, no. Come on. Mildred's final stand. Mildred's final stand. Come on, die, spider bitch, die. Okay, Mildred, your sacrifice is not in vain. Mildred may have tried to kill me, but she made up for it. So, thank you, Mildred, for making my life slightly less painful and this video slightly more entertaining. Thank you. Uh, so, I actually now have the worst part of Blight Town to do, which is actually leaving Blight Town. I mean, in theory, that would be the best part, but no, if you've never played this game before, in which case, maybe watching my video probably isn't the uh, the best first impression of it, uh, then, yeah, basically, you got to go back up to the exit and uh, 
it's just fucking hideous. It is horrible. So before I make the great ascent out of this fucking shithole, uh, I'm going to do another boss. Uh, and this boss I know I can do first try um, without any real difficulty. Because all you got to do is run away, which is something that I seem to be... Well, I don't know if I'm good at it, but it's what I spend most of my time in this game doing. So, so we can just go for our leisurely stroll. Alright, there is the big man. Good old ceaseless discharge. That's a lot of eyes. I think this is supposed to be the remains of his sister and the clothes that she wore. And obviously, if you take it, he doesn't like it. But, I mean, to simplify it, this is the drip that he really fucking wants. And I'm going to take that shit and he's going to try and kill me. I've got it now. I'm never going to wear it, but I'm going to take it anyway. Fuck you. Alright, time to run. I, I have no words for what just happened. Uh, I'm going to do another boss. Uh, and this boss I know I can do first try um, without any real difficulty. Stop the cow. <laughs> Stop the cow right now. I've never died to this guy, to be completely honest. So I don't know what is supposed to happen when he's already coming after me. Well, normally he chases you down here, which I'm sure you might already know. And he gets, like, he jumps on. You can't really see it. You can just see it off camera and he'll jump to the side there and you just hit his arm a bit and he'll fall down. But is he seriously just going to come here and do that anyway? Maybe dying has made my life easier. That's debatable. He looks stuck. Hang on, that, that's his arm. He's stuck, isn't he? But okay, I'm just going to attack this arm and we'll see what happens. So I'm pretty sure it does not take this many hits. I'm doing something very wrong. I'm going to go out on my own terms, actually. I didn't even make it down there. Okay, he's not hanging on. At least we get, we get, that's a cool view. This guy is huge, to be fair. But he's not hanging on. I've done something wrong. Maybe if I run towards him and then back, he'll feel the need to, for some, whatever reason, jump towards me. I love how what I thought would be like <laughs> maybe a couple minutes extra to spot another boss fight in the video has turned into the next massive failure. He's not going to see this one coming in a million years. How am I alive? He's not ready for this. I can assure you he's not ready for this. I'm gone. Literally, I am gone. I don't like to admit it, because I thought this would be incredibly easy and take hardly any time, but I looked up why he ceased his discharges and jumping towards me so I can kill him in a really cheap way. Uh, and that is because, apparently, since I've died already, I've got to run back a bit of the way and then run back uh, for him to actually, like, trigger the jump for me to kill him easily. So, yeah, we'll see how this goes. Okay, so he's going to breathe fire. Actually, no, wait, I'm going to make it. I'm going to make it. I will make it. Look at this. That's the, that's the noise. That's the noise. Supposedly there's a noise that he makes and that means you can run back. Okay, I just gotta pick my moment. This is my moment. Oh, no, 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 it's not my moment. That is not my moment. When is my moment? I don't even know. Okay, now, this is it. He's turned his, no, no, he's coming back, he's coming back. I think he's gonna come back, whatever happens. Okay, this is it. Catch him unaware, look, he's moving back. Little does he know I'm slipping right behind him. There we go. Run, please don't make me do this again. Come on, let's get out of the fucking fog gate. Oh, I might outrun the flames. Stay in the light. What the hell? Okay, so he should now jump towards me. Please jump, jump, no, jump towards me. No, that's not, that is not jumping towards me. It's not working. It's not working. No, I'm trying that again. I hate this boss fight so much. This boss fight is so bad. It's so fucking bad. Well, I, I saw another comment and it said I got to run all the, all the way back to where the, uh, the clothes... Oh, uh, no, excuse me, the drip. Where the drip was. Uh, maybe I'll try that. So, do I have to wait for him to come back over here and then run? Okay. I see if that works. So, I think I got to wait for him to attack once. 
Right, so drink this Estus as quickly as possible and then run. And then run. And then run. And then run. 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 Run the fuck away. So close. Come on. Please. Tell me that counts. I don't I don't want to give up on the ceaseless discharge, but I don't wanna fight the ceaseless discharge ever again either. He's made he's jumping! There we go. Oh, well, that's a fucking relief. Oh, the, uh, the many, many Taurus demons that just stand there doing nothing. Uh, I remember when, when I first saw that, I was convinced my game was glitched because it just looks so, so ridiculous just standing there doing nothing. Okay. This is where the fun begins. We can avoid the poison damage and we can avoid the big insects. That's a good start. That is a good start. Uh, and I have to stand on here at the correct time. Let's see, did this guy stand on here at the correct time? Probably not. I didn't even see the thing show up. So it should be around this time that someone starts sort of shooting at me with a poison dart. It hasn't happened yet. Maybe I have to get off here for it to happen. I can't believe that just happened, to be completely honest. <laughs> oh, fuck sake. Why? Well, at least I'm alive. Although, considering I just did that, I'd probably rather be dead. This is about the bit where I get lost. Yeah, so he sits there and is just a piece of shit. Fucking lot. Oh, no. Oh, and there's so many red dogs here, for fuck's sake. No, don't do <sighs> Yes, here's a ladder. This might be the ladder I always miss. It must. It has to be up here. Come on, I'm, I must be close. Maybe it's not. Maybe, I'm gonna keep going. I'll keep going over here. At least I'll be able to rule this out. I can rule this out. It is a dead fucking end. This is it. This is it. This must. It's just up here. It is just up here. It's a chest. That's the chest. Just double check that it won't try and eat me. It won't try and eat me. This is a chest. Move on the ruins key. I have the key. I have the key. Get me out. Just get me out of here. Freedom awaits. Come on. I can leave Blight Town and never fucking come back again. Good luck. I don't need good luck. I've fucking left. <sighs> Too bad. I mean, the Firelink Shrine music, I really, really like it anyway, but I like it even more after coming back from some fucking horrible place and just knowing that as long as I don't go and get every fucking skeleton in the entire place to try and kill me, I'm fine. So that's the end of the video, and thank you very much for watching. Uh, I don't know how entertaining that was, to be honest. There was a lot of running away from stuff, getting killed by stuff, and there was a lot of complaining as well, whether that was frogs, butterflies, or more recently, red dogs that breathe fire. But to be honest, I'm just glad that Blight Town's done. So again, thanks for watching. Um, I'll, I'll do that thing where I fade out. I do it with every video. Maybe I can put some thought into coming up with something a bit more interesting than just fading out. But um, that's for another time. That's for another video. I'll see if I can come up with any Fuck that up, but I'll, no, I would have faded out enough by then that you can't really hear. It's not a big deal, but I'll, I'll see if I can come come up with anything better. Got it.